Chapter 12, Money. Apu, why are you playing with coins here? I'm trying to form numbers from these coins. Let's see more on how to do this. In India, the currency is called rupee. Do you know what it's called in the US? It's called dollars. All right, in India, we have currency in coins and notes. The coins used are 50 pice. Let's draw that here, 50 pice. Then there's one rupee, two rupees, and we also have a five rupee coin. And the notes are five rupees, ten rupees, twenty rupees. 50 rupees, 500 rupees, and 1,000 rupees. Now using these coins, let's see how we can make a small amount of money. We'll use the 5 rupee coin here and the 2 rupee coin here. And we'll also use the 1 rupee coin. Now how do we get 3 rupees? We can get 3 rupees in two ways. Let's draw it here. We can use one rupee plus another one rupee and another one rupee, which would equal three rupees. Or we can also do it another way. We could draw the two rupee coin plus a one rupee coin. And the answer for that would also be three rupees. Now let us try to get four rupees. Again, we can use four one rupee coins. Let's draw that. One rupee, another one rupee, one more rupee, and another one. Equals four rupees. Now we can use another combination. We can use two rupee coins. That's a coin, two rupees, plus another two rupee coin equals, equals four rupees. Okay, that's two two rupee coins, also gets four rupees. Now, one more combination. Let's use one two rupee coin, and we're also going to use two one rupee coins. So if we add them together, two plus one plus one will give us the same answer, four rupees. Using different combinations of the coins, we can get any amount we want. Let's try rupee 7. We can use one 5 rupee coin plus one rupee and another one rupee coin, which will give us seven rupees. Now, let's try another combination. Let's use the two rupee coins. One 2 rupee coin, another 2 rupee coin, and another, plus a one rupee coin, which will also give us the same answer, seven. Another combination would be a two rupee coin plus another two rupee coin plus one rupee, another one rupee, plus another one rupee. That also gives us the same answer, seven. And now another combination would be one two rupee coin plus one more rupee coin, plus another rupee coin, plus another rupee coin, so we have two, three, four, five, another rupee coin, six, one more rupee coin makes it seven. And now for the last combination is one rupee coin, another one rupee coin, and another one rupee coin, one more, one more, another one, let's count them. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, one more rupee here, seven, equals seven rupees. Or those are a lot of different combinations, huh?